Poco X5 or Redmi Note 12 Turbo. You guys can see I have updated my device with EU ROM 1.0.6.0. Latest version this is based around an Android 14 only. And also you get latest August security patch. Kernel user is 5.10.198 Android 29. This is a kernel use here. Very much smooth experience I have noticed. And these are the apps and there is quick settings toggles as you can see and that each section you also get other options as you can see on the screen guys and this is typical home screen I will be using like this 6 into 6 pattern very much smooth experience already we have the smooth experience as 1.0.5.0 watch that video before watching this video and this is the camera interface no Leica integration here since it's a EU ROM and everything is working fine here security application is like this you guys can see about version and in the Play Store all apps been updated as you can see in the previous version the basic application is not going to update uh, that is going to fix there and I'm using all the applications too everything is working fine here I haven't faced any issues here and again in the additional settings you get all these options like memory extension up to 8 GB I'm using the full slit here floating windows working fine other these accessibility and other settings are also working fine here battery mode again I even tried performance mode and running benchmarks we'll be showing that within a while and fingerprints face unlock everything is working fine app lock is also again sound and touch again all the necessary options are given here like Dolby Atmos and Equalizer that's going to work fine here no problems regarding those things display and brightness again switching between light and dark mode as you can see the wallpaper is on somehow you guys can see I switch to dark mode screen brightness and light mode is there color scheme again saturated I can't even keep it warm also you can customize them the image engine I have turned on the HDR enhancement refresh rate however I set to default and then switch to night mode I want to show the world with as you can see very quickly that will be changed press and hold here you get a number of widgets and these things you need not to download them so for all the spray installed in this ROM very much handy and very good experience I am getting with this particular ROM the battery life is also good and charging speeds are also very much good I can say and these are the things you get no iOS kind of style here it's EU ROM again you are familiar with what all the things we get and what all the customizations we get in this particular ROM into connectivity on BSNL same I am using for some reason today I didn't got 4G connection I'll be showing some results actually I'll go into gallery here like Geekbench scores without turning on the performance mode this is the score what I got with turning the performance mode you guys can see on the status bar the performance mode has been turned on hence the scores are like this really a lot more improvement you guys can see in the single core it's huge improvement turning on the performance mode this is with a to fiber connection with Wi-Fi this you can see BSNL 3G plus that's what I recorded I haven't take most of the screenshots like in the previous version you can check out that but major difference is in the uh, smoothness in the way it has been improved a lot I can say the app opening times everything is very smooth guys the experience is very much good again you guys can see history with uh, performance mode turned off and with performance mode turned on it's a huge difference in single score you can use it by turning on the performance mode and this will the toggles and some core features like as you can see dynamic island whatever you can see of hyper is still available as you can see I like that sounds and coming to this one lock screen customizations you also get that but you have to wait for this yeah, these are lock screen customizations as you can see. These are still present. You can definitely use them and customize them. These are some hyper OS changes. 
that's pretty present here will be working fine no problems regarding that and if you have any specific questions regarding this particular room comment down in the comment section guys you guys can see the fingerprint unlock it's fast and accurate again as you can see very much fast i can say and the face unlock is even faster than fingerprint unlock as you can see just tap gets unlocked here bluetooth everything is working fine stereo speakers are sounding fine here and the headphone jack via 3.5 mm headphone jack are also working fine i haven't faced any issues guys regarding battery performance smoothness everything is very good on par to any of the other relatable roms here you guys can see on the screen it's very good response i can get from this particular rom as you can see even recent apps everything is working fine let's see bgmi how it handles on this particular rom guys you guys can see the performance is boosted up to extreme plus only in which rom will get 120 fps that i already shown you check out that video i will be giving that link in the description also check out my separate playlist available for this device poco f5 in number of readers i already made different types of custom roms already covered you guys can check out my channel definitely regarding these poco f5 custom roms it's really good uh, the strong having very good gaming experience here you guys can see it's an all round round base you guys can see even in the counter attacks i did not face any live and the performance mode is still uh yeah it's turned on you also get these options here that will be handy the game space or game or whatever it is available I am really happy with the performance and the software experience. Everything is really, really good. I can see here in this particular room. If you're still having any questions and if you're not watched all the videos, first watch my all the videos I have made for this Poco F flashing method. Everything is given in the description on my channel. There is a separate playlist also regarding Poco F5. You can check out that. Yes, this how the Poco F5 5G custom ROM that's EUS custom ROM it's really good guys right? and if you want to use it as a dial driver definitely use it as a dial driver we'll meet you with another interesting video guys until that keep smiling bye bye for now